Jones, reporting from Afghanistan. In the top of the news today, Alan Peterson, CEO of Horizon Data and creator of Soma, the phenomenally successful app for mobile devices, has gone public. Wall Street speculators believe he will command $20 billion in this offering, making him one of the richest men in America. In other news, it seems that economic recovery is certain. Michelle! Stuart? Well, I'll be. What are you doing here? You know, I I've been meaning to talk to you. Hush yourself! Stuart, why don't we take it easy here? Do you wanna. You wanna call? I said, shut your mouth! Alright. Move. That's right. <laughs> A little more quickly now. Stuart, I, I know why you're here. Back up. Now have a seat. Right there. Put those on. Lock yourself up to the radiator. That's right. Quickly. You heard about the app, right? How well it's done? You lying, thieving son of a bitch! Stu, Stewie, Stewie. You know me. Let's make this thing right. You know it's too late. You know it's too late. To the wide world and all her fading sweets, but to thee. Forbid one last heinous crime. <laughs> now take those. Come on now. Come on now, Mr. CEO. I want you to eat the whole bottle. That's right. There you go. There you go. There you go. <sighs> Damn it, Stu, you know I done taking every drug day is. It ain't like gonna have any effect on me. Just take your medicine. I lost everything working on that app, creating Soma. <laughs> that app was supposed to help people, not hurt them, not turn them into mindless addicts. <laughs> Please don't kill me. I pluck the teeth from the keen tiger's jaw. Pity you.
Señor, señor, estás bien, señor, ven acá, Juan, ven. Hard to believe. According to a recent Bloomberg report, Alan Peterson, founder of Soma, the most successful app for mobile devices, has all but given away his mighty fortune. And today, the Children's International Fund is five billion dollars richer. Many were surprised by this generous donation, and his motivations remain a mystery. When asked why by reporter Linda Abrams, Mr. Peterson had no comment. Thank you for joining us today. This is Ron Cooper. BBC News, London.